Hey everyone, it's a very exciting day for us as a family with Shreya Putti coming home soon. So I better buckle up and speed up. There is lots that we have set our minds to once she's here. But before that, my baby will be very hungry. So I am making some dishes today that I know she would love to try. She loves all that I keep trying for my videos to share. Uh, so today I am making a dip first uh, that will be uh, a great accompaniment for crisps or as a filling in tortillas for which I have a tin of mixed beans uh, that I drain the water and then I wash it thoroughly with running water. Now onto a pan with a tablespoon of sesame oil, a teaspoon of cumin seeds, half a teaspoon of onion seeds which is kalaunji, one onion finely chopped and when they are half done that's when I add in a teaspoon of garlic and ginger paste, one orange bell pepper, one tomato and then adding in mixed beans. This is basically chana, kidney beans and black eyed beans which are boiled and ready to use. And then I add in a handful of sabaske soppu which is dill leaves. Good amount of coconut milk giving that rich and creamy flavour. I add in salt to taste and then I am using hot and fiery fajita seasoning mix which is around 2 tablespoon. This turned out to be so good that we could just finish off the whole in one go. You can also use it uh, for chapatis as a coconut curry. You can use, eat it with rice or bread or naan. But we thoroughly enjoyed it with crisps. Now making creamy rich broccoli and cauliflower pasta with penny shells. Now onto a large pan with one star anise, two cloves. One bay leaf, and pasta shells. I also add in salt and then water. Letting the pasta shells come to a good boil. And then I have cut broccoli and cauliflower. Broccoli and cauliflower turn out to be a great combination. I cut them into florets, adding in hot water and covering it up for 3 to 4 minutes time to remove dirt, residue and bugs which is not very clearly visible after the first wash. Uh, with the vegetables being so entangled, it is difficult to find any bugs. Also, uh, these vegetables will get cooked faster once they are set in hot boiling water. The pasta shells are cooked. I retain the starch as it's very little. With a tablespoon of oil, 5 grams of butter, 1 big onion finely chopped, a teaspoon of garlic and ginger paste. I also add in broccoli and cauliflower. I sauteed them for 3 to 4 minutes time and you can see the change in colour. This is when I combine them to the pasta. With a handful of the leaves, sabaske soppu, 3 fourth of a tin of coconut milk. Add in generous amount of pepper powder and salt to finish off. Now onto a tray with big chunks of onions, bell peppers and paneer. I spray in oil to be air fried for 5 minutes time at 190 degrees temperature.
Onto a foil, I place these tortilla pockets, covering them up from all sides in which way they will retain being soft and get cooked. I place them together in the air fryer for 5 minutes time at 190 degrees. Vegetables are beautifully grilled that I sprinkle in fajita mix as a good seasoning. Keeping everything ready on the table as Chinu will be home soon and Santosh and Sanika are set to the train station to get her home. Where do you want to do that? Yes, you do it. Yes, you do it. Yes, you do it. Yes, you Yes, you do it. Yes, you Yes, you and we are all hungry too. Um, these are lentil bites that we bought from Asta. They tasted excellent with the coconut curry. My Kandamma is home and home is home with everyone at home. It's Easter holidays. Come study holidays for a month for her. And she has been missing us and home cooked food. And we have missed having her home a lot and I have missed her in all my videos so you will get to see her more in all the upcoming videos who um, give me a great company in all that I do being my shadow. So we fill up these tortilla pockets with paneer, onion and capsicum slices, a bit of gravy too. It tasted amazing and you can use roti, naan or even a bread slice as an alternative to these tortilla pockets. Easter holidays begin for us, uh, taking things slow and easy to enjoy my time with family and I'm just waiting for the sun to shine brighter and warmer. I have continued my day being a creative, working on my next video and I'll be sharing in lots with all that we do as a family in celebrating days ahead. Thank you so much for watching this video in full. See you all in my next video. Mm.